Um, yesterday I went and gave blood. I've given blood since I was 17 years old in high school. And I don't know why I did it then. Uh, people say, oh, how noble. Uh, it's not noble. It's not fun. Uh, they stick your finger every time to find out your blood type, which it's like, hello, same person. Uh, blood types don't usually change. And my blood bank here in Switzerland has gone to a bigger needle, right? Uh, which is really painful. It doesn't, and I said, can I use a little or need? No, it's policy. We have a new needle. Oh, great. Thank you very much for making this uh, experience even worse than it has to be. But why I give blood now is I, a friend of mine hired a Tibetan Buddhist healer who was well-versed in Ayurvedic medicine, and he came to her office and was doing consultations. And I got some herbs and stuff, and he said, Wow, you are pita pita pita, which Ayurvedic has different qualifications, um, pita kapha vatha, or something like that. And pita 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 is, means I run hot. I run My whole system runs hot. I'm always warm. And he said, you build up waste products real quickly. And he said, one of the things that might be very beneficial is for you to give blood a couple of times a year, once at least, but a couple of times a year. Now, George Goodhart, who innovated kinesiology at chiropractors, said one of the reasons he thought women lived longer than others is because they have an excess, an, an auxiliary detox method, which is their periods. Once a month, they get rid of their bad blood. So, uh, after having done something intuitively for years, I now go and do it at least once a year. Um, I'm not allowed to in America, by the way. America has sent all their bad blood to Europe, right? And this is a fact. You can look into it. And so they're worried that I've got a disease, which I'm really, really healthy. So they sent me this shit letter, said, you cannot give blood if you try to, we'll arrest you. It was from our federal government, who's looking out for us, of course. And uh, I can give it here in Switzerland. They test it. They make sure I'm healthy, which I am, by the way. But I can no longer give blood in America. But that's a whole other story. When I was 17 and I was in high school, uh, I would go with my friend Richard, uh, uh, Richard Latimer, okay? And uh, we were sitting at the end where you sit at the tables and you get cookies and juice or whatever you want to drink. And Latimer looked at me and he smiled. <laughs> he would do stuff like this. And then he fell forward and it, it what looked like a dead faint. <laughs> and if he hadn't smiled at me, I would have really believed because he hit his head pretty hard on the table and I got laughing so hard. And it was these who worked there was these older women. They were real nice. They were volunteers, I think. But they came running over and picked him up, and I I couldn't stop laughing. Well, then they started yelling at me. And I said, wait, 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 wait. I, I didn't do this. I'm just enjoying him. And they said, well, you're laughing at him, and this isn't a funny event. I said, it's, I know what's going on. I knew he was. But they continued to yell at me and not him. But Latimer could do that. Uh, just real quickly, we went go-karting one time. He came into the pit stop, got his foot stuck under the brake, couldn't get it on top of the brake came in and hit the last go-kart in the line, and bang, 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 away the go-karts go out onto the track. And I can't believe he's done it, and I'm laughing. And the owner of the go-karts comes up behind me and starts yelling at me. And I said, I didn't just mess up four of your go-karts, you idiot. He did it. Go yell at him. And he said, yeah, but you're laughing. I said, yeah, I know, but I didn't do it. But thank you, Richard Latimer. You enhanced my life. You made me laugh. I hope this made you chuckle at least a little bit. Have a fun day. Uh, happy holidays, www.mi.com.